Happy Halloween and welcome to the grand finale of the 31 Days of Horror series. We made it to day 31 and we're wrapping up this wild ride with 2007's Dead Silence. Yes who, fat boy? March, March, look! Ah. Oh my god! The doll's trying to kill me and the toaster's been laughing at me. A film that turns ventriloquist dummies into the stuff of nightmares. Directed by James Wan. This movie is one creepy atmospheric trip down a haunted memory lane. And if dolls didn't freak you out before, they sure as hell will after this. So here's the story. We got Jamie, whose wife gets murdered in a brutal, eerie way after a creepy ventriloquist dummy named Billy mysteriously shows up at their place. Jamie heads back to his hometown to get to the bottom of things, only to uncover the local legend of Mary Shaw, a ventriloquist who let's just say didn't exactly rest in peace. Her dying wish? That no one would ever speak her name again. Well, good luck because she'll make sure you stay silent permanently. Dead Silence is one of those movies that really leans into atmosphere. It's got foggy streets, a haunted theater, and of course way too many creepy dummies staring back at you with those dead soulless eyes. Juan is a master of creating tension, and here he combines the classic ghost story vibes with that signature eerie doll aesthetic. It's like he took the creepiest parts of the Twilight Zone and cranked it up to 11. And let's talk about the scares. This isn't a blood and guts kind of horror. It's all about the tension. The silence itself becomes a weapon. Every time the sound drops out, you know something's about to go down. And it keeps you on edge. Plus, Mary Shaw's rules. If you see her, don't scream. That's horror gold right there. It's such a simple rule, but it ups the tension like crazy because you know you're going to want to scream. Dead Silence is a perfect pick for Halloween night. It's eerie, it's creepy, and it's got that dark, ghostly story that'll stick with you. If you haven't seen it, now's the time. Just remember, keep the light on if you have a doll collection nearby. And that wraps up the 31 Days of Horror series. Thank you so much for joining me on this insane horror journey. Releasing a new video every day was no joke. Trust me, it was a lot of work but sharing these horror gems with you made it all worth it. Hope you found some new favorites, got a few scares, maybe a laugh or two. Just wanna say thanks again for watching, have a happy Halloween, and we'll see you next year. You're still here? It's over. Go home. Go!